Busy, busy, busy morning for you, Bob. Yeah, it goes fast when there's some weather going on. Yeah, we definitely on. have a lot going on here. We have our weather headlines, wet, breezy, and cooler for today as a cold front moves across our area. Pretty much everybody's getting wet this morning. An unsettled weekend shaping up and warming next week by a little bit, also drying out a bit, but that won't happen until about Tuesday, Wednesday. Here's a look at Doppler radar as a cold front pushes across southwestern Idaho. Pretty much, like I said, everybody's going to get in on some showers this morning at some point in the morning and some heavier downpours in some locations, and even some lightning. There's a lightning loop going back about three hours in the early morning hours, mainly to the north. But uh, in just the last few minutes, we've been seeing some lightning in uh, Malheur County, southern Malheur County. Also quite a bit up here around. Oops, <laughs> I dropped my little remote. Excuse me. <laughs> anyway, we have a few lightning strikes around uh, Cascade. Uh, Probably getting a bit of a light show up there around Cascade, and it's uh, coming down as well uh, as we switch back to radar. Got some heavier downpours just to the west of downtown. It looks like uh, the uh, rain showers will increase in downtown Boise. Also some showers around Caldwell uh, stretching into uh, Nampa. And uh, back here in Boise, looks like uh, just west of the connector, the Flying Y, we're getting some pretty good downpours in west sections of Boise. Here in downtown Boise, just some really light showers. Here's our big picture, our future radar as we go through the time steps here. Here's 7 o'clock this morning, still raining, still raining at 9 o'clock. But as we head into noon time, we're going to definitely see the showers winding down. Also, in the middle part of the day, we might see some breaks in the clouds for maybe a little bit of sunshine after our unsettled start. Right now in Boise, we have 56 degrees, winds at 17 miles per hour. Satellite loop has... That uh, cold front pushing across southwestern Idaho, you can see that on our water vapor, and this is a low pressure trough that will keep us a bit unsettled as we head right through the weekend. Here's our future cast computer model. Here's the front pushing off to the east by noontime for today. Then a little break in the action, but then more showers rotating our way pretty much all day during the day on Friday right through uh, 11 o'clock, right on through 9 o'clock in the evening. Some passing showers possible. Also Saturday. Later in the day, late afternoon, early evening hours looks kind of wet. So here's our high resolution future cast computer model. Here's the front pushing on through some breaks in the clouds at noontime for today. Might even see something close to mostly sunny skies by 5 p.m. But then some more rain showers coming through Friday morning right on through 9 o'clock. So here's what we're looking at as far as our forecast. First off for the Magic Valley, increasing clouds, cooler and breezy. Some rain, isolated thunderstorms a possibility. For Sun Valley, a high of 58 with mostly cloudy skies, an isolated shower or a thunderstorm. McCall and Cascade looking at daytime highs in the lower 50s with unsettled weather, mainly this morning. Rain showers this morning. Might actually break out to some mostly sunny skies, but cooler and breezy today. A good 15 degree temperature drop behind that cold front. Some rain showers, isolated thunderstorms this morning, and then partly cloudy skies, cooler and breezy. And then Friday, most of our rain later in the afternoon and again on a Saturday, mainly late afternoon, early evening and uh, Sunday for that matter. And then our showers finally tapering off a bit by Tuesday and Wednesday and warming up slightly. That's Liga Weather.